Hey, Gina, that's right. So our interview with the city just wrapped up about 20 or 30 minutes ago. While they say they're working hard to address the catch basin issue, a lot of people are concerned because they say their catch basin is still clogged. So take a look at this video that we shot not that long ago. Now, this was in the Irish Channel area. There was a lot of crews out working hard to try and address this issue again. They're cleaning out catch basins. They were shoveling, pumping and hosing out debris. The city, though, says since August of last year, 25,000 catch basins have been cleaned out. They say, though, they're working on a plan to address all 65,000 of them. Now, this is what some of the catch basins look like this morning in the Treme area. Some were clogged with grass and mud. People who live in that area say something has got to be done. How would you feel if it was your home? What would you want done? Put yourself in our shoes. But when the water rises, you do see debris and trash and bottles, different things come floating up. Every day we have crews going out and cleaning them. And then separately, we have outsourced the repair of a lot of catch basins as well. And that program continues. But since we've come in, you know, we're, re we're looking at that team that's doing that work. And those folks work incredibly hard. Um, with, you know, equipment that is pretty complicated and, and takes a lot of physical and mental focus. Um, but we want to make sure how are we scheduling it? How does it stand now? And we're looking at that now. So currently 115 of the 120 pumps are operational. There are more than 500 open jobs at the Surgeon Water Board. Reporting live at City Hall, Aubrey Killian, WDSU News.